don't care about trail guides. Alright, Bill. Hmm. I think it's up to the mill surplus, then across and back down. Multiple dumps adjacent to each other. A library, and I've already hit that craft shop. I haven't hit that library either. So, what are we sitting at? Stop running. Whoops. Alright. Need to find a quiet place to hole up for just a minute. Didn't get all my points back. <laughs> Dang it, so close to the basement. Um, They'll definitely follow me into the basement if I just dive into there. So, we'll go... <coughs> Shock zombies in the dump. All right, no wheels. Might have ammo in the turrets. Then two forty nines. That's a lot of ammo. Um. No, this stuff's too close. Too close to risk. I think the shock zombie killed itself in the pits or the fences for the dump there. That's kind of fun. What can I see? Wire, rags, gallon jug. Nothing interesting in the dump, huh? Okay. Um, it's going to do the mill surplus, but... I'm already pretty much right at the uh, the library and the bookstore. Easy cloud. Oh crap. I shouldn't have sped that one up. side. Um, yeah, just staying right with me, which is a problem. Good. All right, need the door. Mm, what kind of uh, lamp? A smart lamp? What the hell's a smart lamp? Batteries? Hmm. Light batteries, just just light batteries all around, huh? Can be activated remotely. Huh? I don't remember ever seeing a smart lamp before. <clears throat> so we'll grab the lamp. Um, I've already got screwdrivers. We'll grab the copper wire and the solder. I think I've already got solder actually also. 
just going to grab the lamp and the copper wire and go out the front. And grab that too. Alright, stop running. Need to find a place to get my stamina back. Yeah, it's quite the crowd there. I can only see a portion of it so far. Running out of interesting places to go look. Um, we're gonna be down to house searching here pretty quick. A mill surplus way up north, and the one more library, and that's pretty much it. We've hit all the right recycling centers. We've hit all the libraries and bookstores. Yeah, I'm not seeing much else. How's our weather looking? Even better. Ugh, gotta take advantage of this. What time is it? <coughs> 4.30! Ooh, uh, we're not gonna get another trip. So, let's see here. We gotta get around this, this crowd. Little guy's moving awful fast. I think I might hop in this thing and drive home real quick. This will get me a storage battery in our base area if I can get it back home cleanly. I don't see why I, I won't be able to. It's damaged, but I don't care. I'm just going to use it for welding and stuff for now. It'll give me some more raw materials in the area. Hey there, Jerry Kerstetter. Let's park it right down here for now. All right, well, that was a little quick, quicker trip home than I was anticipating. Uh, we'll read those. Really should just leave the guns home. I'm not going to use them. All right, so there's our new list. Um, hey, I got a Fab 3 book. So we've got Fab fully covered now. I got Fab all the way as high as I need it. We've got uh, 3 to 5 or 6, and then 6 to 7, 7 to 9. So Fab's completely taken care of. Not a hint of a tailoring book yet. <laughs> no tailoring. Um, I'll, I only want to get to like 3 or 4 so I can get the backpacks made. Not a single tailoring book. Unarmed combats... Now we've got computers handled up to five. Can get us a little bit of easy dodging skill. 
Hey, we got piercing weapons of three now, so now we can get some better advantage out of our spears. All right, not bad. Not a bad list. Um... Fifteen out of thirty. What else am I carrying? It's oh, the shovel, safety glasses. That'll help. All right. So four fifty. Do I dare take another trip? Nothing real close that I can really benefit from. Um, I could take the bulldozer around and um, arc up here and then quickly hit the uh, the mill surplus plenty of gas <coughs> yeah I don't see a reason why not to Take the bulldozer out. All right. Alternatively, I could take the bulldozer out and real fast drive over here. And what could I hit? Another bookstore. School would be a little tougher. Uh, I'd have to go pretty deep into this place to get to the good stuff, it looks like. So we're probably going to have to save that for another another evening. Uh, let's go ahead and work our way around here. Yeah, I, I'm having problems with the uh, evolution stuff <laughs> as well. Finding that sweet spot. I think the evolution dial itself, you just ignore. <laughs> I don't think that's going to help. I think it's just the uh, start date and the, or the evolution start time. Those two are pretty much... I think it's these two. Finish, or no, these two. These two, initial day and spawn delay. I think those are the ones you got to play with. I don't think this is going to do much. I've played with that a ton. I had it on 0.5, and I still wasn't getting what I was expecting. Okay, let's hmm. <laughs> Taylor so awesome monthly. Well, all right, I'll take it. I guess we're stopping. care about any of the rest of that stuff. Care about the evac shelters, sporting goods stores might have something in them. Let's see how cleanly ah shocker brute in the area. <laughs> shocker brute in the uh, the building I was looking at going into. 
No, thank you. Shocker, shocker, shockers. And big old dog packs. A lot of dogs. Alright, so the mill surplus is not quite due south of me there. I think I'll leave the uh, vehicle here. Butcher's knife is it, huh? That is some empty, empty shelves. Um, and I, I guess. disappointment <coughs> sewer is not going to help fire station is going to be pretty hit or miss at this point I have to go pretty deep in to get to that last library this one's done already looked at the dumps yeah I uh, I didn't get to that gun store, but I'm not super worried about that. So yeah, everything else is um, not too excited about. I think we're already looking at having to go over here next. 5.05. Hmm. <laughs> it wasn't 10 videos, True Heart. It was 33 videos. <laughs> yeah, I'm aware. That was my first experiment with trying to clear out my four-month future log of accumulated episodes. I have since um, researched, gotten some feedback, and have a different way of doing it from here forward that won't uh, spam everybody's uh, sub boxes or their notifications. So... <clears throat> yeah, we're definitely not going to make the next town before the sun comes up. Probably I should just roll back around and head south. I think what I'll do is we'll, we'll roll north on this road right the northeast or northwest of us and we'll see if uh, we can get up to that hazardous waste sarcophagus grab the uh, free ID card see if there's a vehicle in the bay maybe get a free gas mask oh even better even better hey there free excavator all right, bush of ultimate <laughs> pissing me off. Uh, fine, I'll go around you. Hey there, free excavator. Nothing in the box. There's the engine crane that I needed. <coughs> 2.0 liters, 8 gas, or 8% battery is plenty. Faulty engine, worn drive belt. So it's not going to charge the battery. I'm not sure 8% is enough to get this thing down there. We'll probably conk out before we make it. And 
and I don't have what I need to remove the boom crane. Just need mechanics three to come up and remove the boom crane. Hmm. So we um, dragged a welding rig back to our uh, garage, and now we've located the uh, the engine crane. It's just a matter of do I want to try to move this vehicle back down or we'll leave it here for now. Mechanics 3 will let me rip the engine crane off. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alright, uh, this is a bit more up and around than I was really again planning on doing. Oh, we have no headlights in this thing, do we? <laughs> I forgot about that. No headlights, so if we lose the, uh... Oh, I'm inside the view. Can't see it. Yeah, right on the edge. Never mind. We're not going that way. No headlights. As soon as I lose the uh, the view, I am going to be screwed in driving this thing until the sun comes up. So, we'll go visit that another time. Yeah, we'll wait. Alright, now we're gonna go around. Demon spiderlings. body site here I'd like to get the mp3 player and the cash cards and maybe one or two other things and uh, running over firefighters would be great yeah come here, come here you guys no he keeps the noise from the other zombies hitting the vehicle keeps them hugging the thing. I don't think I'm going to get it. Whoops. <laughs> That's not quite the way I wanted that to go. Ah, let's just leave it alone. There's another weirdly pathing shock zombie. <laughs> it's 
does this weird sprinting action and then uh, comes to a halt for no particular reason. Well, they fixed the focus pain, whatever issues are affecting combat. Yeah, they fixed that. <clears throat> for a while there, quite a while there, painkillers didn't do anything. And uh, alcohol was uh, ten times more effective than it was supposed to be. They did eventually fix that. So painkillers are back to doing what they're supposed to, and alcohol does what it's supposed to. Yeah, I know, Drew. <laughs> The funny thing is, I have seen three bandit bulldozers in this challenge, and we're we're on day three, and I've seen three of these things. I saw two of them on I think day one, and the third one on day two. Only one of the three actually works, but uh, it works plenty well. <coughs> I love the bandit bulldozer; they're fun. All right, and we're back home. And back home we go. Alright, we're back in our little nook. Uh, I think I left some stuff in the bulldozer. Okay. <laughs> Need lots more batteries. So we got so awesome monthly. Ooh, we can get tailoring one. That's pretty exciting. <laughs> I can get that just by making bandages. Makeshift bandages. Faster than I can by reading the thing. All right. Magic system is magicalism. Yes, it's a, a mod called magicalism. Active world mods, magicalism. All right, let's... um. <laughs> Let's see here. What do I want to focus on next? So it's going to be daylight here pretty quick. Uh, we are still in Perceptive Healer, of course, so we got to be really careful with my, my hit points. Um, how many batteries do I have? I have hardly any batteries laying around. Work on mechanics so I can make sure to go get the crane. Once we get the crane down here, we'll have everything I need to... Uh, well, I don't have a solar vehicle here yet, but, um... Oh, actually, no, I do. I forgot. I brought that one solar vehicle down. I have everything I need to make sure we have all the welding power that we need for anything we want to craft. Oh, that's right. I got the, uh... I got the full hammer now, so I can do the, uh... The pipe... Pipe spear. Let's upgrade! Let's get off this frail spear. So, we're gonna do a pipe spear. Oh, chunk of steel's fine. Hey there, Pipe Spear. Let's compare these poor things. So, Simple Knife Spear. A damaged Simple Knife Spear versus a Pipe Spear. <laughs> bash 3, Pierce 13 versus Bash 6, Pierce 20. Both plus 1 to hit. Uh, pipe Spear is 1 point faster moves. And Pipe Spear gains Impaling Strike in addition to the Medium Block. And it is not flimsy does conduct electricity, so don't be stabbing shock zombies with it, but I'd never do that anyway. So yeah, that should be a nice upgrade. <clears throat> we'll try to take advantage of that with our sojutsu. Um, 
So get rid of the knife spear and I'm gonna keep the baseball bat just a little while longer, I think. And get rid of the butcher's knife. Alright. <laughs> Bird baths give rebar when disassembled. <laughs> okay. There we go. <laughs> you know what? I did all that running around in the city, and I totally forgot. <laughs> I did the I did the whole thing without even bothering to do my main buff, <laughs> my synaptic stimulation, that would have made running away from things so much easier. <laughs> Oh man, too much, too much city raiding for me. <laughs> I just, uh, I forget to even use the things I've got available to me. Um, so yeah, that was kind of silly. All right, we've got, I got enough in in uh, random food types to last us a day or so. So we're tired. Let's do the same thing. It's already six thirty a.m. So we're gonna we're gonna read for a few hours. We'll sleep the day away. And we'll see if we get clear skies again for another night raid. Probably hop over to that other city if we do. <clears throat> All right. So let's um let's see. I got the first aid to three, so our bandaging will be more effective. I think. I think. I think. I want to do. Piercing to three? Ooh. That would be really, really helpful for spearing things, but I also really want to get my mechanics to three so I can go get that engine crane. So many things to choose from. Let's do this instead. Let's do bandages. What is my focus is 60. Now. Um... Yeah, I need to start picking up more batteries. I gotta start killing zombies so I can get their batteries out of their stuff. Nah, I don't think I'm gonna waste it on those yet. I need to keep a hold of my batteries. Alright, let's do uh not tailoring. Let's do bandages for the tailoring. Too many. Yeah, I'm out of rags. I probably shouldn't have wasted. Oh, actually, I'm not out of rags. Oh, that's regular bandages. Never mind. We're okay. All right. Ah, 98. <laughs> oh, 31 makeshift bandages. Fine. So, there's tailoring one. That didn't use hardly any time. Uh, let's do... What, what do I think is more important? I'm not in a super big hurry on the mechanics, I guess. So let's go ahead and do piercing. Let's, let's get some skill on our actual weapon. There's level 1. 745. Keep going. All right. Whoops. Burn that flashlight. All right. More image. And... Good enough. I should boil those first. Keep forgetting that. Uh, yep. Off sleep we go. Oh, I'm getting dizzy watching those hit point bars race to the top. <laughs> uh, I do love imperceptive healer trait. 
Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing moved barely. I think we got I think we got what part of a bar on torso. Good times. Uh so 8:30. It is clear. Uh, sun's not quite down yet. Please stay clear game. That would be awesome. That would be really really wonderful. Uh let's go back to not the flashlight. And it went cloudy. <laughs> of course it did. As soon as the sun was about to go down. Super hot. Yeah. Grizzling. Nah, keep reading. Unless it goes clear and stays that way. We're not going anywhere. And just rain. All right. So we're not going to get the advantage this time, looks like. Eh, I don't really care about the food rot. <laughs> it's like I don't care whether I start in zero day of spring with all the frozen stuff. <clears throat> that Food and temperatures and all that is essentially inconsequential for me. I just know the game too well. So, evolution of the zombies is really the only factor I care about. All the other secondary effects of fiddling with those is not of concern. The vending machine nuts don't rot, so <laughs> that's all I live on nowadays anyway. So we got one more level we can learn. Uh, it's cloudy and rainy the entire night so far, so we haven't gotten a break in the weather, unfortunately. Um, let's, uh, I want to check out this smart lamp and see... Yeah, put the big battery in there. I want to see just how long it seems to last. <clears throat> Activate. Smart lamp. Is it just smart or is it also efficient? Let's find out. 156. One hour. Two hours. Three hours. And it's burned... 100 out of the 300. Yeah, that's not going to work well enough. Clear skies, 5 a.m. Of course there's clear skies at 5 a.m. Did I not notice it go clear skies? <laughs> um... House rating is about the only thing I could do of use, and it would only last for about half of an hour, so I don't think uh, we got a long enough time we can take advantage of this one, unfortunately. Maybe I could get to the library and the dojo, but I'm planning on sticking with Sojutsu. The dojo is kind of irrelevant. Yeah, let's not. Let's not risk it. I am out of planks. See, that's not good. Being out of planks is bad because there's very little wood in this place. And I'd have to import the wood. Um. So yeah, that's that's not good. I knew that was going to be a problem. We've already blown through all the local wood except for the doors. Hmm. I don't want to drag firewood down here. Uh, 
guess we're gonna keep burning battery power. <clears throat> Yeah, I'm kind of using the bookshelves to block the light. Alright, so we got piercing weapons to three. So we've got the uh, full advantage of the Sojutsu. And uh, our base weapon type. Skilled up a bit. That should help. Hopefully uh, between the upgrade to the spear itself and the uh, piercing three, we'll get some fairly effective stabby stabby going on. Nah, I'm not doing a solar-powered base. <laughs> um, uh, what I have to decide is whether I'm going to keep the uh, the Bandit Bulldozer or not. That's really the only choice. Put a cargo space there. Anything else I do is kind of tough because it's going to... Uh, if I try to open the sides or the backup, basically, it becomes a problem because then shockers and that have a line of sight on me as I drive by. Um... So, is a single cargo space going to be enough for me roaming around, or do I cannibalize the bandit bulldozer, grab the uh, spiked rams and the treads, and throw them on a Humvee, for example, which is my uh, my favorite vehicle. And um, the treads and the spikes are awesome to uh, mod onto my Humvees. But i got to find a Humvee and get it back here if I plan to do that, and that takes... Eh, not a ton of, of stuff. If I get a Humvee in decent shape, I could mod it the way I want it pretty, pretty quickly and easily. Um, I have just about everything down here already. So, we'll see. We're going to be doing a lot of running around. Alright, so let's turn that off and dump that, dump that. So we are very hungry. It's going to be time to sleep again. Um, yeah, let's just get that done. We'll, uh, grab some more makeshift bandages. Alright. Ooh. I saw that bar change. <laughs> Four thirty. Ouch. Uh <coughs> that's way earlier than I thought I'd wake up. Hmm. Well, let's take advantage of a few hours of uh, reading time. Let's go with... <laughs> dance, dance, dance. Followed by... Mechanics, I think I need to start working on. What I plan to do, that's why I have this little spot right here, minimizes my exposure. <laughs> Might get it done before the sun goes down. Close, close. Oh, 99%. <laughs> of course, 99%. And now we have the problem. I'm about out of batteries. <laughs> I'm out of wood to burn. So now we have the problem. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff on. It's just uh, the torso that's very hot. Yeah, I guess my arms are a little hot too. It's because I put on this extra stuff. 
<laughs> we'll ditch the uh, the underwear. Do do do. All right, can't even light the fire. So, the three bookshelves and doors are all I have left for uh, planks. <laughs> Bit of a problem. <coughs> hmm. No, I don't plan on staying here. Um, I'll loot out the two towns nearby pretty quickly and um, need to get on the move. In order to find more magic stuff, I have to get moving. You, you can't do a stationary location to try to do any of the magic stuff because it's too rare. You got to be moving around a lot to keep trying to find new books to uh, to train off of um, and the other magical spells and such. So you end up moving around a lot. We got a pretty big city area over here that's going to take me some time to, to kind of look through. So we're not leaving anytime real soon, but um, getting the vehicle modded up will be pretty helpful. So, I can't run the bulldozer at night. Not going to run the solar vehicle either. Um, haven't started working on mechanics yet, and we're out of uh, we're out of either wood to burn or uh, battery power. Hmm. I go outside, I'd have to travel with the flashlight on, which I can kinda do. But my night vision range without it is so bad. <clears throat> it's gonna be super dangerous, especially for a imperceptive healer character. <laughs> well, I'm thinking of running up to uh, the area up here and smashing some young trees to get the uh, long sticks. And uh, I don't have a saw or an axe to chop the trees down yet and make uh, big logs we could bring back. I need at least a few so I can at least do uh, <laughs> cook up some or boil some water. Let's pop outside. See if we can find a couple of local zombies we can poke with our spear real quick. I just want to see how effective it is. Either tough zombie. Uh, let's see. Run away for a second. <laughs> All right, we are synaptically stimulated. Now we'll get out the pipe spear. Of course, we miss. Bad for twenty six. 24. Problem is, as soon as I turn this off, no night vision. I get in big, big trouble. Survivor zombie. Um,
Damaged Remington. Uh, how about we just unload that? Now, of course, the noise is going to attract things to the area I'm currently hanging out in. All right, baseball bat. <clears throat> tonight I still had some planks. That's fine. All right. At least we can do a little bit of work. Uh, oops. Get some water. Nine thirty. No. Uh, need the. Uh, need this. Need to clear skies. Yeah, the gun basement's got some stuff in it I still need to go get to. Nah, it's not so dangerous right now. As long as I'm careful about putting on my my uh, movement bonus, the synaptic stimulation. As soon as something triggers, I can get away from it pretty easily as long as I'm careful not to zero out my stamina. So, whoops. That's not what I needed. Let's uh, extinguish that. And I've got some carry capacity. Let's leave those again. We'll go ahead and go to the uh, gunsmith basement real quick. Safe mode on. And... Excuse me? Oh, I made a Technomancer rune. <laughs> Damn it, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. Alright, safe mode on. Where am I? <laughs> I don't remember where the basement was. Oh yeah, this place was occupied. I forgot about that too. Whoops! Alright, that's a little rude. Kit, huh? Mm, Putting steel purification tabs. Eh. Not too excited about it. <clears throat> hmm. Pink tabs.
All right, wrench I didn't need. Need the handle, don't need. Oh, it's just a strap. Cool, strap I do need. Uh, unload, AR. Attach the strap, and wear AR. All right, where was the stuff? Reloads. Eh, better than nothing. All right, that's all the things I care about, it looks like. I have to put the reloads into there if I wanted to do that. Not gonna do that right now. I think we're all set. Well, about a 30, that still leaves me a little bit of room. Come here, baseball bat. there in Kulaf. All right, so no spare 223 laying around except for those reloads, which are a little less effective, but that's fine. Uh, 18 is plenty of shots for my emergency uses for now. We got the pipe spear for our main melee weapon and the uh, baseball bat for our backup bashing weapon. Uh, so we can spend some time reading again. 10 p.m., Keep working on, I think I'll start to work on mechanics next. Or do I want to get some dodge skill? Nah, let's get the mechanics done. Whoops. All right, clear skies. See if we can take advantage. Uh, carry capacity is good. Look. Up zombie again. Oh, yeah. Definitely got to take advantage. All right, so it's midnight. That gives me a pretty good amount of time. Let's kill this guy real fast. <laughs> 